Hey guys, this is Mativi Maxson again, and in this video, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to connect to your Windows computer or your Windows server. That's on your local network on Ubuntu. So first, we are not gonna need any third-party softwares. The software you're going to use comes pre-installed. It's called Remina Remote Desktop Client. If you just type remote, and it will should come up. Just click it to open it. Once it's open, I already have a server set up here, but I'm gonna be creating a new one, a new instance of this server just to show you how to do this. So I'm just gonna create, click on this button to create new, and I'm gonna give it a name of TV server. The group is not necessary. Make sure if you are connecting if you are connecting to a Windows computer that you choose RDP, which stands for Remote Desktop Protocol, because that's what Windows uses, and Mac OS uses VLC. <coughs> so here you should put in the address for your server. As mine is a local server, I'm just gonna put in my local IP address of my server. choose this one for faster speeds for the connection to be faster but I like high quality more but so far I'm just gonna leave it to poor just to show you how it would look like when you choose poor and <coughs> this so sound just gonna leave it there to do it thing and thing like that I'm just gonna click save and just come and double click it to connect as you see it's connecting Just gonna choose full screen so that it shows it, it shows it in full screen. So as you can see, it has successfully connected to my Windows computer, and you can pretty much do anything here. Open up any program that you feel like opening up, like you can open up CMD or any other program. You can use your Windows computer on your Ubuntu, uh, or you can use both of them at once. That's what I always do when I'm testing some network program. <coughs> so now, for high quality, if you want high quality, because I hate this, this is poor quality. I want a poor, a high quality stream. So I'm just gonna come here, go out of full screen, and just disconnect it. And right clicking, click on edit back to add events and choose this instead of four and just click save go to double click and immediately in a couple of seconds it's gonna be connected as you can see it's high quality even if wrote the background of the remote computer and as you can see Thanks you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next videos.